Good afternoon, everybody. The sun is in my eyes and I cannot see a thing. Um, I'm confused, I guess. This is not where exactly the place I had in mind, but you know, that's okay. So this is a camp, this is a campground. It's right down the road from the river where I usually go. It's called Keystone Landing and um, it's on the river as well. Um, it's just not the place I thought it was. I mean, uh, you know, that's just me though. So, there's this little place. I've never been here, so we'll check it out together. I haven't seen y'all in a while. I did get those post thingies on my channel, so I've done a couple of those. Oh, the Sandhill Cranes, y'all. They were fantastic it made me want a real camera that you could actually see stuff with um the only reason i knew there were cranes i thought they were geese at first but i figured out there were cranes because when they were landing their big old legs were hanging down and they were they looked grayish like a grayish tan i guess that's sand colored so this is all dnr department of natural resources and I've never been down here. So I guess if you stay at the little camp here, which is like 15 bucks a night, y'all. You can go right down here to the river. So let's go check it out. That looks a little perilous. Don't you think they would have cut that down? Eventually it'll give out. <laughs> Something will give. So quiet down here, y'all. How pretty is this? We have, from what I understand, about another week of good weather. And then it's supposed to get cold. <clears throat> Let me sit right on the edge here for a minute. Do you see these trees right here? I, I don't know what they are. Does anybody have any idea? They're just so fluffy, just little fluffies. I thought they were some kind of spruce or pine. And I guess I just don't notice them in the summertime when they're green. But when it turns to this time of year, they kind of look like a cypress or something. I don't know. If anybody knows, let me know what they are. But I thought I'd just come down here and let us have a minute of the beautiful river. When it's still nice and warm outside. Things are going good on my end. I've been busy this week. <clears throat> the boys are teenagers. And so that's that last little step is a doozy. You see that? And so for Halloween, they of course don't want me like trick or treating and holding their hand anymore. So I actually let them stay in town and hang out with their friends and I went and picked them up and it all went smooth everybody actually showed up when they were supposed to uh, and then Tuesday we had a trip to Cadillac and I saw the sandhill cranes and there is some beautiful farms I'll probably put a post of, of one of the cornfields I took a picture of I couldn't take a picture of the farm because there were people there some of the most beautiful farms, y'all, on this little country road. Big giant barns, big white farmhouses. Oh my goodness, I wish it was my family. I wanted to walk up to the door and say, can I stay? <laughs> can I live here? Isn't that pretty? But I have a beautiful house, too. I mean, don't think I don't appreciate what I have, y'all. I do.
It is just so peaceful out here. I'm glad I came. I almost forgot because I did a bunch of errands. I picked up uh, at the Dollar General. I thought I'd pop in there. I came I came into town early before I picked up Isaiah to uh, get toilet paper and paper towels. Um, and I get them at the Family Dollar. That's where I find my best deal for those. And I popped into the Dollar Tree to see if they had any, you know, candy or whatever left over. And I did find a bunch of 50 cent candy that I can, I bought a whole box of it that I can send off in Christmas presents and stuff like that. Because it's only a month away, y'all. Um, and what else did I find? Oh, I found a couple of beach balls for 50 cents. And, you know, that's for the camp next summer. I'd rather pay 50 cents than a dollar. And something just came up in the water right there, y'all. I'm guessing it was a trout. I'm surprised nobody's not out here fly fishing. Because it's so beautiful. I'm picking a picture of that tree. Got a little bit of a dam going on over there. Do you see that on the right hand side? Let me see. Point it out to you. Right there. There's some logs and stuff all building up right there. And they look like cut logs. I don't know why. I don't know. Somebody was trimming. Oh, I see. It looks like there used to be a little walkway here and there's not anymore. It looks to end right there. You see that? Maybe that's what that was. On Doc Martin's cabin, he calls that a corduroy road. Where he makes it with his logs. Alright y'all, that's my beauty for the day. And I hope my talking through it didn't disturb the peace and tranquility of it. Because it's just gorgeous. And remember... If you know what those trees are, let me know in the comments. Now let me make it smaller. Woo! Okay. Alright, I hope y'all have a wonderful day and enjoy this good weather that hopefully everybody's having. If not, you know, rain's okay. We need rain. But winter's coming, y'all. And everybody keeps saying it's going to be a long one. We'll see. Take it easy. And thanks for watching. Thank you very much.